Terry Schaefer with NapervilleGuitarLessons.com. Today's video is for the advanced beginner and the intermediate student and anybody that's got a good handle on their church leg or it's also called the harder leg. What it actually is is a bass strum. Today we're going to talk about arpeggiated strumming. Now an arpeggio means that you play each and every note of the chord. And there's a million different patterns and a lot of different ways you can do it. You can finger pick it. Arpeggios have their use and they're a lot of fun. but. Today we're going to talk about the arpeggiated strum. And basically what that is, is you play two arpeggiated notes of the chord, and then you finish it by strumming. Now what's key to this is having a down, up, down, up rhythm, and to keep that going. It's crucial to it, in fact. For instance, on a C chord, with the C chord, I play a down strum on the A string, up strum on the D string, and then I strum the remaining strings down and then up. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up. With a D chord, it would be a little different. Down on the D, up on the G string. You want to make sure you're holding your pick correctly. chord down on the E string up on the D string and strum through Sometimes it can almost simulate finger picking. I like to use it when everybody else is just doing the happy go lucky type strumming. If you have any questions, please go to my website, www.napervilleguitarlessons.com, or on Facebook, www.facebook.com slash Thank you. Mm -hmm.